Okay, so I said I'd do this video ask, answering questions. I've had one and none ask me to answer all the questions but one. Um, I tried doing that. The video is 20 minutes long, so I'm not going to do that. I'm sorry. Um, I'll just do the ones that are in my inbox. And it's like midnight. My parents think I'm asleep, so I'm going to have to be quiet, okay? Um, if you could kiss someone from Tumblr, who would it be? Oh, I've just forgot. Um, also, my mic goes out of sync a lot. I don't know why it does it. It's just really, really shit. Um, okay, if you could kiss someone from Tumblr, who would it be? Mm, I'd kiss... Hmm. Paddy? Or Yayan? Or Simon? Yeah, I'll put all their URL there, URLs down below. Um, has anyone put me from me seeing you naked? Yes. I don't know why that would be such a weird question. Um, how many people have you slept with? That's for me to know. I'm not going to tell you. That's a little bit personal. Do you have feelings for anyone at the moment? If so, where are they from? I do. All I'm going to say is that you... Uh, I can't speak, I'm sorry. All I'm going to say is that they live north of me by quite a bit. Um, okay. 38... 38, 99, 8, and 102. 38. Um, do you think someone has feelings for you? I don't know. I really don't. I doubt it because I'm invisible to most people. 98. If the person you like says they like someone else, what do you say? I had this the other night. Um, the guy that I have really strong feelings for and have had for a while. I found out I always had a girlfriend since the start of March and he didn't tell me. He had pictures of this girl on Facebook and I asked, you know, if he was seeing her. And we talked about it and stuff and he and then we talked the other night and then I went and then I went on to his profile by accident and saw he had a girlfriend and that hurt. Finding out through Facebook really hurt. But it's all sorted now, but it still sucks and like it hurts feeling that. But at the end of the day, as long as they're happy, I'll live. Um, has anyone ever given me butterflies? I think two people have managed to give me butterflies before. And neither of them live anywhere near me. They've managed to do it over like Skype. So weird. Um Um, someone else has asked. I don't realise I had so many questions, oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying, I'm trying. Um, somebody asked me, is there, is there someone mad because you're dating to the person you are? I'm not dating anyone. I, don't, I really don't think there is. What are you wearing right now? Right now, I'm wearing my Charmander onesie. Um, where's the tail? It has a tail. And it, um, has a little hood as well. <laughs> yeah, it arrived today and I love it. So I've been wearing it all night because I'm really cool. I'm wearing it to school on Friday, the non uniform day. I'm going to stop being so lame now. Oopsie. I pressed something on my phone, sorry. Um, and they've also asked me. Do you like watching scary movies? I love them, but I have to have someone to watch them with because I get freaked out and scared like really easy. And I need someone to kind of grab hold of. <laughs> yeah. I need to have someone's arm around me. I don't like it's really weird. I don't like the feeling of having my neck exposed when I watch them. It feels really vulnerable. Um I went to Drayton Manor. No, it wasn't Drayton Manor, it was Thought Park. And um, my friend made me go in one of the mazes that they put on, a, um, on their Halloween Fright Nights. And we were walking through it, and at one point it was pitch black, one of the actors was crawling around on the floor. And I grabbed hold of my ankles, so I kicked them. Oops. Um, and then at the end of it, I was getting really freaked out, because they seemed to be targeting me. And I had my f we had to walk in a line. 
my friend was in front of me who had like a hoodie gilet on and I put my I had my face like buried in a hood because I just couldn't bear it anymore and one of the actors put their hand down the back of my neck I hate people touching my neck their hands were cold I screamed fuck off and ran out oops <laughs> um I still feel really bad about that Um, okay, so that's last me 4.27. Get more going. Okay, would you ever smile at a stranger? Where I live has a lot of elderly people, and I have a pet Labrador who I walk sometimes, and it's one of those places where you don't know the person, but if you both walk indoors, you're both out walking. You just smile at each other. Everyone here is so lovely. Um, who was the last person you talked to before you went to bed last night? I don't remember. I was on Skype with my friend Kieran. And then he fell asleep. So I was like, okay, that sucks. I think it was Paddy. I'm going to guess Paddy because I was texting him last night. Um, has any one of your friends ever seen you cry? Yes. I've had too many break breakdowns at school this year, um, and I had a full blown one last year before my French listening GCSE. That was fun. That was because of my ex boyfriend. Um, I managed to get an A star in it. So fuck you, Curtis. I shouldn't have said his name. Oh well. Um, do you have someone of the opposite sex you can tell everyone to? I do. I'm really lucky. Um, I have a couple of um, friends who are guys that I know I can always turn to. Like, Kieran's one of them. He lives in Glasgow. It sucks. Yian's one of them. Um, he lives in Wales. Again, it sucks. Uh, Mike, who lives... Well, he's at uni in Nottingham. And um, Paddy, who's at uni in Newcastle. And Jack as well. I think Jack's at Newcastle. Yeah. So none of them live here, so I rely on text, Skype and phone calls, but I know that those are guys that I can always turn to, because they give really good advice as well. Anyway, you know the name Michael? I know two Michaels. One lives here, and one lives up in Glasgow. Is the last person texted attractive? Indeed he is. That's what I'm going to say. Um... Oh, just got a text. Okay. Paddy's drunk. Fab. Um. I'm just going to think of this. Well, that one, that's that one. Why are you so fucking hot? I'm not hot. I don't get why you people think this. I'm really not. I am nothing special, I promise you. If you want to see hot and beautiful girls, look at the girls at my school. They're fucking gorgeous. Without makeup. Ugh, so jealous. Mm. I think that's it. This is like 10 minutes long. I'm so sorry. I've just wasted 10 minutes of your life. I feel really bad now. Ah. <laughs> but if you've watched all this, thank you. I love you. Have a medal and a cookie. And come here and you can have a hug. In my big fluffy onesie. Which I can actually fit two of me in. Be careful not to flash. Um, so yeah, bye bye.